Hello viewers, I want to show you all the current update of uh, ongoing Eclobia flyover. So now they've started hanging the beams and the slabs. So the last time I was here, I told you all that this section of the project will commence soon. So it has already commenced. So today is the final day the beams the last beams are being hanging so i want to update you all for you all to see the wonders professor charles soludo is doing here in the globe to transform an umbra state a whole lot is going on across the state a whole lot is going on across the state so this is one of them so all you are seeing here are the slabs uh, after hanging the beams uh, these slabs uh, will be used to cover them then before they will start filling up and construct access road on top of the bridge for those that are new and those don't know how this project started this project started sometime last year fully so here was a global roundabout uh, the roundabout was demolished to give way for this flyover so it's an intersection road this one is going to Oku, the other one is going to Oka, the other one is going to Okiti to Newi, then the other section is going to Oka. So the governor is also dualizing from Oga, our boundary with Imo State, all the way to Oka. So I'm sure I've been showing you all the progress of work. So here is Eulopia flyover. So they are hanging the last beams today. You can see the standard bridge done by AG Vision, unlike most flyovers here in Southeast. This is standard flyover. This is standard flyover. You can see the quality of work they are doing here. The under will be open. Very long flyover. Governor is not just constructing flyover, he is also building modern bus terminal here in the Globia and Fire Station. The ongoing dualization will connect to this flyover uh, from Oga to Oka. It will link up to this flyover. All the four major roads that connect to this flyover been dualized by Governor Saludo, the one going to Oko is being dualized, and the one going to Oketitine is being dualized, and the one going to Oka and uh, Oka are being dualized. So the one going to Oka and Oka will link up to the already ongoing dualization. Monitoring the progress uh, to show you uh, what is going on here in the member state. Also, remember that the governor also proposing to dualize from Wago in Aglo down to Newe. By the time this project will be completed, the sorry state of Ecuador will change for good. Eplobia is the fourth city in Anambra State, fourth major city in Anambra State. Eplobia gradually wearing a new look, so you can see the long flyover of Soludo is constructed. Eplobia is finally changing. Once he's done with this, next will be new. The governor is not relenting. Every part of Anambra State is witnessing massive construction. Every part is witnessing massive construction. 
just two years and few months of his administration, a whole lot is changing. Imagine the time he completes his eight years in office. At early stage, many ignorant minds were complaining about the flyover. I told them that this is not a Tea Party project. So they know what they are doing. AG Vision is doing a standard work, including the road they are dualizing. There's provision for walkway, flower, and uh, street lights at the middle. So, Governor Soludo is doing a lot. By the time he's done with an state, you will see the difference. Also, the bus terminal they are constructing. You know that this company is doing great. So, let me take you through for you all to see the progress of what's going on here in Florida.